Hi, Chris Gainer here, and in this um, uh, video I'm going to uh, show you a new plugin that I found a couple of days ago uh, that I've been using on my uh, website. This uh, is a basically a free plugin, although there is a premium version, but um, it's called Magic Action Box. And um, so I'm basically going to just type in uh, the actual plugin, the name of the plugin, and then search plugins. Just wait while it loads. And there you can see it's a uh, magic action box. Basically, this plugin. Uh, is free as I say but there is a premium version uh, but basically what it does is it enables you to create um, multiple opt-in forms on your underneath your or underneath your blog posts or uh, above your blog posts um, and here it, here here it is uh, on the left hand side of the dashboard so I'm just gonna uh, show you quickly what you can do with this plugin uh, quickly here. So if we go to action boxes and we add a new action box you'll see that there's uh, a selection of boxes you can actually have. You can actually have a share box for sharing your content, a sales box uh, which is basically to lead your visitors to a sales page or you can have an opt-in form. Now obviously um, if you want to create recurring income online then uh, the best way to do this would be to just put an opt-in form on your uh, website or blog uh, to capture email addresses so uh, we're going to just pick the opt-in form as I say this is there is a this is a free free plugin but there's also a premium version um, which I'll go into uh, detail uh, just uh, in a, in a, a bit later. So uh, now we're on to actually creating a uh, magic action box or box opt-in or whatever you want to call it. So I'm just going to call this a, 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 a t test. Test. Um, now there's different um, styles you can have for uh, this particular for for an opt-in you can have dark which is what I've got on my uh, website you can have uh, royalty which that looks quite nice uh, pink uh, depends uh, whether you whether you like pink or not um, but I like the dark um, one uh, the next uh, bit is uh, select your mailing list provider and effectively uh, ju you just need to use other because it will s automatically set it to Aweber or MailChimp uh, so you, you just need to uh, use other keep it as other now this is where you go to uh, uh, your autoresponder provider and uh, get the code for uh, the HTML code for your so when you create an opt-in form in Aweber or MailChimp or GetResponse or iContact or whatever autoresponder you're using you basically uh, get the co HTML code after you've created the opt-in form and then paste it in here um, once you've done that uh, here you can also um, this is where you basically just uh, tell your uh, readers what, where they can, how they can get their their uh, gift, their free gift. So, for example, you just type in uh, "get it now," and then uh, you process. What you do is that would process the button for the. The, uh, the, uh, the form and then uh, this is where you would write 
uh, your copy for the uh, opt-in form. So, for example, free uh, free gift inside reveals uh, how to get more traffic to your website. Blah de blah, uh, and then you'd create the subheading. Uh, enter uh, your details below to uh, grab your free gift, etc. So once you've uh, basically you can also add an image as well um, but I think just having I don't think having an image I don't I, you can choose either way to have an image or not have an image um, so obviously you can place the image uh, right top or left etc but once you've created the form uh, it will show up it will show up here as you can see test I've already created a couple of opt-ins um, and I'm going to show you what uh, it looks like uh, in a in in a in a minute um, okay so this is a magic action box so I'm just going to show you what the opt-in form would look like on my website so the opt-in form so if we click on we click uh, if we go on down here that's what your opt-in form will look like uh, with a magic action box so basically uh, that's magic action box and uh, the, 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 the beauty of magic action box is you can have an opt-in form anywhere on your blog uh, you can either have it there or you can have it at the top even if you want it um, I've obviously got I'm obviously using another uh, uh, list building uh, plugin here called sticky list builder uh, so that's there but as I say I was I've been looking for a while for a, a plugin which puts an opt-in box like this at the bottom and I stumbled across Magic Action Box basically by using uh, a product I purchased uh, a few days ago called Spybar Plugin. I came across on somebody's website that they were using Magic Action Box. So again, Spybar is another useful uh, plugin because it basically um, allows you to spy on people's websites and get plugins that you didn't know uh, existed or you thought were maybe paid plugins but are actually free so magic action box is free but as I say there is a premium version I'll leave a link um, at the bottom of this uh, video for you to check it out uh, and if you want to install the the free version then go ahead um, Okay, so so uh, this is Chris Gainer signing off for this video. Uh, thanks very much for your attention, and uh, speak to you soon in another video. Okay, thanks. Bye.